Hello, everyone. Welcome to Everybody Arts. I'm Mr. Matt. We miss you. Who? That was the sound of me blowing Emma's adorable intro. Sorry about that. What's your name? Emma. <laughs> Let's do that again. Hi, everyone. I'm Mr. Matt. And I'm Emma. I suppose that works. Let's, let's just kind of move on from there. My, my bad. Anyway, I made these and I just did that. Uh, we put out the video this week and uh, Emma helped me with a lot of it, but she didn't end up in the video because um, I was trying to, it ended up being so long. And if I keep explaining all about that, then it, this one's going to end up being long. We're not going to do that. Um, but when it gets down to it right now, I wanted to paint them and color them and cut them open and show you what it's like inside and, and how to keep the lids on and everything. The only thing you're gonna need a grown-up for is to cut the pumpkin open on the top. And if you wanna cut up, cut open the front part, um, you can paint them on your own. You don't even have to cut them open. They look really awesome by themselves. And um, it's hard. That one, not so much. That, I actually did that one with regular, like um, white glue, school glue. And um, careful. I, she, Emma liked that one and I was smacking it around and, and it was denting in and she's like, no, 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 fix it because I like it. So yeah, don't bounce yours. <laughs> <laughs> do as I say, not as I do. That's my motto. And make sure it's dry all the way. Yeah, so I'm not going to destroy any more pumpkins. We're just going to cut them open and, and paint them and paint details on them and possibly uh, do some other fun stuff. Okay, guys, uh, for the carving of the top, I figured I would just leave it to your parents to decide it, uh, how they want to do it um, because you have to have adult supervision to do it. I don't want you guys doing this on your own because it's dangerous, really. You have to have a very sharp knife to cut open the top. And um, the paper mache pumpkins, they're very thick and, they're, and it's very difficult. And the possibility of you hurting yourself is very real. So, um, yeah, quote, unquote, we're going to cut this part of the... Uh, the uh, video out. You just ask your parents if they can cut off the top for you. Um, I ended up cutting out Emma's too. So uh, yeah, there's that. I, I just didn't want to um, leave that in there. I just, just for safety's sake. Yeah, just be safe with your uh, pumpkins and, and how you're uh, working on them, okay? All right. There we go. So, oh, look, okay. Now I know that they can see this. Yeah. And there's, that's, that's the uh, balloon. There's your Dixie cup. Remember that part? How cool is that? And you can see the little rubber band impressions. And um, yeah, there you go. Oh, you can see in it perfectly. Let's dump that out. Ew. What? It looks gross. But that's so funny that you can see that there. Um, if I was careful, it's actually like a real I could, yeah, it is like a real pumpkin. Look, I pulled out the guts, which happens to be my uh, oh, balloon and the things there. You could just set it on top and not worry about it too much, but if I wanted to put it back exactly the way it was, it kind of rests there. I don't have to worry about that. I, I was going to try to tape something inside of it, but I think I'm pretty happy with that. I think I'm going to leave it. Mine's in. You, I think, still have a balloon in there that hasn't popped. Ooh. Do you want to draw like a very incredibly light line where you want me to cut? Yes, one minute, 37 seconds later. Okay. Oh, is this? Oh, wow. What? This is one that I didn't use um, rubber bands on. This is when I was thinking I was going to use string. Wow. That looks crazy. So the string, it, it was probably full of glue and it's hard to pull out. So, but it's coming. Let's do it delicately so that we don't put it on the top. Without, sorry, dishwasher's on. That's my fault. I'm like, oh, our dishwasher's super quiet. It's not gonna make any noise. <laughs> it's gonna do more, I know. Should I start talking again? Okay, I'll start talking again. Yeah, the, see, look, I had to hand tie each one of these around the, the uh, balloon by myself. It's still making that noise. What? The dishwasher's making that crazy gurgly noise. Oh, yeah. It's have... like someone's choking. Yeah, exactly. Anyway, I painted these like a week ago. And um, check it. I kept my paint. Um, it got a little messy in the bag, but I put it in a styrofoam uh, 
bowl and I mixed it in a styrofoam bowl and I put it in a Ziploc and it's fine after like a week or so. But uh, I'm gonna probably repaint the edges of this and like on here, I'm just gonna do that really quick. And if you wanna do the same here, you can have that. Uh, paint the edges, what do you mean? Here look, you gotta take it up and this is what I'm doing. I'm getting the edges so like, yeah. And, and if you look here, see that? Yeah, you wanna get that. This paint smells so good. Does it really? Yeah. Well, I did like temper paint when I was in school, but yeah. It does smell good. I didn't know if this would be smelling still okay after how long we had had it in there. I'm gonna try to feather this out a little bit. You said blend it in? Like, um, like this, like wipe that off, like until it's almost dry and watch. Use it, use it like a dry brush when I say blend it. Um, squeeze that out there. And then, um, yeah, just kind of like this. so that you don't have a lot of paint and it dries kind of quick, you know what I'm saying? Why are you doing yellow when green makes blue? Yellow and green doesn't make blue. Yeah, it does. Well, it makes green. Yellow and blue make green. Yeah, what does that color make? It's gonna be more towards like a brown. So now, yeah, that, what I was gonna do, since I've got this like brownish mm -hmm. color right now going on, is um, if you look at the lines on these pumpkins, mm -hmm. um, they're dark and they go down on the sides. Now, when I made this, it got kind of goopy and a little bit, um, whatchamacallit, um, uh, cracked and things like that. So it wasn't exactly the way I had planned, but I did want to be able to paint some of these lines on them. Now look, Emma, when it, when it dries, it does, it dries lighter. See that? Look, that's dry already. So, um, I, you know the best game that like everyone plays? What's that? Um, Among Us. That's what I hear. It's so good. You, you had to like, um, so, so someone's the um, imposter and um, you have to figure out who it is and if you lose and you don't guess who it is, um, uh, they tell you who's an imposter, and it's like fun, and then you get to do tasks, and then whoever, basically you play with people, and um, yeah, it's cool. That's cool, it does sound fun. I've seen like the characters from it, it looks funny. I want it. There's nothing but memes everywhere about that game. Now, if I want a brown, brown, I gotta make green and red. Oops. <gasps> I forgot it made purple. What, green, blue and red? Yeah. Oh, sorry, I'm really pushing that into your knee. I'm fine. Is that the one that you broke? I didn't break my no, knee. The... Oh, that my ankle I broke, yeah. That was awful. Don't ever want to do that again. It still hurts sometimes, believe it or not. Really? I don't know what it is, but yeah, when it rains and stuff, my, my uh, ankle hurts and uh, I broke my hand once too. You didn't tell me about that? Uh, I think I'm sure I did. Oh, you didn't tell me about that? I was rather reckless when I did it, so I probably shouldn't talk about it. Yeah, I broke it at skateboarding, but I'm very bad at skateboarding, which is probably why I broke it. Um, wow, that is super pretty. Um, mine's really dark right now, but I know that it's going to lighten up, and I don't want to keep adding colors to try to make something lighter when I know it's going to be lighter. Do you know how to make a butterfly? <laughs> you throw it out the window? What? Like butter. How to make butter fly. You throw the, the stick out the window, the butter stick, stick of butter. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know how do you make a butterfly. It was, I thought it was funny, I'm sorry.
You should put some like cool music. Like not the everybody arts music regular one. You should put like I could play music like that, but I'm I was starting to think that I should just not make my own music anymore and just pull it out of the library for free. No, I mean the, the YouTube library, because they have a ton of free music on there. It would save me a lot of time. But okay, guys, we're going to put some cool music. You ready? Three. Well, I'll definitely do it now. Two. One. Go. Dance around like, you're, like you've got some really awesome music you're listening to. That's what YouTubers do when there's like no music and they edit it. And then they're like, hmm, pretty good dance button. Well, I think that's good for now. I might come back to this at another time and, and play with it, but I, I like my pumpkin. Like I said, I'm gonna put some more orange over the top of that so that's not as pronounced. Um, that's it. I'm not gonna do much else. I think it looks pretty good. I'm doing a leopard. You're doing a leopard? Yeah. A leopard pumpkin, huh? That was Emma. I'm Mr. Matt. That was Everybody Arts. Thanks for watching. Yeah, wait, uh, wait hold on, hold on. What? Wait, let me wash my hands and do the outro. Okay. Be be good to each other. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I always do this at the end of the video. Bye. Hold on, hold on, hold on. See you later. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, I'll have to so Okay, guys, peace out. I'm tired. Me too. Ah, oh, my bag. Poopies, I gotta make dinner now. <laughs> I got. It doesn't stop. I'm